as a physical world. It is not really to the physical eyes, but it is as real as the physical world. So it is a force. If it is a force, then it is a spirit. If it is a spirit, then we miss and need to begin to look and say it from the spiritual perspective. Can I hear you? <laughs> we put it last year. I'll give you this example, then we'll go for In Luke chapter 8, from verse 44 to 48, the woman with the gifts of God demonstrated something. <laughs> Glory to God. This is what the woman did. The woman said, In our hearts, please pay attention. If you can grab it, you have gotten it forever. I got it, it's working for me as fire forever. The woman said, In our hearts, is that what the Bible says? That if I may be God, the hell of this God, I will be made whole. This implies that the operational base of faith is the heart. Please listen. The heart is the operational base. Romans 10, 10. For we the earth, man, believe it comes to salvation, and with the God, believe it, and with the God, confession is made unto salvation. So, the heart, your heart, not your mind, is the operational base for your faith. That is why it is a force. If you have to make use of faith, you make use of it with your heart and not with your mind. With your heart and not with your mind. The woman said, if I may be pleased out and touch the hand of the she released a force. And the word of God. Get to the woman the power that produces a living proof. And we define it say that faith is a spiritual force that has its source in the living world producing proofs. Living proofs. I'll read. Faith is a spiritual force that has its source in the living world producing a living proof. God blew my mind yesterday and I said, what my children are going to say? I, that same scripture, for with God, not exactly possible, is that correct? With this everything God can do, is that correct? Is that correct? But God blew my mind yesterday. I was on the table and I opened that door and I read it again. For with God, nothing shall be possible. God say no. For with my God, which is the living stuff, nothing shall be possible. For with the world, for in the beginning was the world, and the world was God, and the world was God. Now 
your heart. What it means to say, if I want to make faith work for me, then my heart is what I need to take care of. Now, hear me. This is what Apostle Paul told the church in Ephesians chapter 6 and verse 10. He said, Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Be strong in the Lord.